Hi, welcome to Advanced Elixir and OTP by Pact Publishing. Elixir is a fun and exciting new programming language built from the ground up to help you create scalable, reliable, distributed applications with a friendly to use syntax and tooling system. I'm João, and I'll be your guide in this learning journey. Before we start, let me tell you a bit about myself. I'm a software engineer with eight years of experience in building complex distributed systems and applications for the banking and telco industries. Over the last years, I've developed a passion for functional programming, and in particular Elixir, which I've discovered about two years ago. I've been using it since to develop and maintain production systems at the company I'm currently working at. I'm also an avid learner and enjoy doing photography and small electronics projects in my spare time. And without further ado, let's take a look at the course overview. This course is designed to help you learn and understand advanced concepts regarding the Elixir programming language and is divided into eight sections. On sections 1 and 2, we'll continue where we left off in getting started with Elixir and dive deep into Elixir collection data types with streaming computation and protocols. On section 3, we'll introduce the most important concept in Elixir, the process. Processes are the building blocks of concurrent applications in Elixir, and it's very important that you learn to use and master them. On sections 4 and 5, we'll learn about some advanced constructs that will help us build more complex applications with tabular data, and even extend the language itself with metaprogramming. And finally, our last three sections, 6, 7, and 8, will be all about the OTP framework, and it's there that we'll learn how to build proper Elixir applications with a powerful set of tools. At the end of the course, you'll be able to use Elixir data structures more efficiently and be able to solve various complex problems with them. You'll also be able to understand and explain the concept of processes in Elixir and how to use them. Finally, you'll be able to build complex applications using the OTP framework in Elixir, making use of all you've learned before. As prerequisites, it's advised that you've had some previous exposure to functional programming and be somewhat familiar with the Elixir programming language, as there will be no introduction to the language per se in this course. If you don't know Elixir syntax and would like to know more, there's also Getting Started with Elixir by Pact Publishing, which I recommend taking a look at. Finally, in order to do the exercises by yourself and try out the code examples, you'll need a relatively recent version of Elixir installed, Version 1.4 at minimum, the 1.5 or above are strongly recommended. I hope you enjoy this course and find it useful, as Elixir is definitely one of the most exciting languages out there. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next section and be prepared to learn and face some challenges along the way. Now it's up to you.